Hey guys, I'm your girl Jenny Beauty Reviews. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and staying safe. Today's video, I have my BoxyCharm Base Box and BoxyCharm Premiums for the month of February 2022. I thought I would unbox these with you guys and share what is all in the month of February um, that BoxyCharm has to offer. And at the end, if I find that I can try on some products, I will definitely do like somewhat of a try on, maybe full face, um, and you know, implement these products into that full face or try on whatever situation so i think we're gonna have a lovely time together um if you like videos like this please give it a huge a thumbs up if you are new please subscribe it's that red button right there down below click it and then right next to it you want to click that bell that way you are notified when i upload a new video i think you guys will be so excited to see what i upload because i have new videos coming up that we'll be posting i think every other day i will be posting something or every day i'll try um but yeah if you are excited please give it a huge thumbs up and leave me sweet comments down below i greatly appreciate it and definitely watch from the beginning to the end that's the best way to help me and my small channel grow and get watch time i am so 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 close to my watch hours those four thousand is like so like I can I can see it it's like so like it's right there it's so close just help me help me help me please I really appreciate it that way when I get monetized I can you know get some money 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 and implement that into my channel you know I can get finally hopefully a camera one day because I record from my phone um and just make some changes to my youtube channel and purchase things that are like new releases and more better giveaways and have extra money to pay for those giveaways because i do international giveaways and those can be so 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 expensive but anyways we're gonna get into these boxes i've been talking for a couple minutes and i'm like very thirsty right now so excuse me one second <laughs> okay i am ready to tell you guys about this base base box from boxycharm here it is i'm so excited i got this on the 8th and i got premium on the 8th and the base box on the 9th um and i haven't been able to sit down to record this so i thought we would have a nice relaxing video and maybe an hour long or so and i hope you are down for this hour long a video so yeah we're going to open this up they've changed the prices so i cannot like remember on the top of my head maybe it's 27.99 or 30 bucks i will leave the information in my description box so definitely go ahead and check there and i will leave my boxy charm um referral link that way if you guys want to sign up and use my link i think i get some points or something like that um i actually had two accounts i canceled one and i forgot about this account so that's that's why i have these so we're gonna unbox them um so the base box is red on the inside it looks like that and i'm very excited um trying to find the card and i don't think i don't think i have a card okay i don't think i have a card so we're just gonna go right on in and I will implement prices right here on the screen so sorry I just don't see a card in here so um, I don't remember if I was able to choose like I said I thought I canceled completely and then I forgot about this account so I don't remember I don't think I chose anything um, but here's the first item this is the glow palettes from ace Butte. I love ace Butte eyeshadows and their products are so good like okay um so this is the glow essentials highlighter palette Ooh, here's the packaging so excited like i said i love their eyeshadow palettes their eyeshadows are so great to work with so easy and really great quality oh it has a good size mirror and here are the shades so pretty and like bronzy tones Ooh, I'm loving the shade right here called Poppin. This one right here is so gorgeous. It looks very reflective. It looks like it has specks of like pinky purpley tones, like little specks in there that look so pretty. They all look stunning. I am so excited. Maybe 
I will try that out. Maybe I'll put it to a side for a giveaway. I'm not sure quite yet. I do have a lot of highlighters and highlighting palettes, like face palettes and stuff. So I don't know if I want to use that, but it's very gorgeous. I'm happy to have that. The price will be right here. I apologize. I don't have the card. Um, Next item is this. Ooh. Oh, I have this already. This is from Wander Beauty. This is the Wanderous Escape eyeshadow palette. Oh, yeah. I have this already. And if you want, give me a second and I'll go grab mine. Here's my palette. And this is the one that I just got. So we're going to swatch mine. Here's how it looks on the inside. It's very gorgeous. I do have swatches on this hand. So I think I'm going to do it on this one. So let's go ahead and grab a few. These shadows are great quality. So pretty and pigmented. And I love the quality of Wonder Beauty. A lot of people don't really talk about their brand. But I'm actually... Um, doing a full face of Wonder Beauty. That way you guys can see what they have to offer. And these shades are so beautiful. Absolutely pigmented, stunning, and I love that blue. so happy with this palette and I'm gonna actually set that one to a side I forgot to bring wipes <laughs> I forgot to bring wipes <laughs> excuse me my bad <laughs> so this is that palette and it's completely sealed so like there's a sticker there and then sticker so it's completely sealed and I'm gonna put this away for one of you so this is for a future giveaway and now this is mine as you just saw beautiful i swatched it um so i will put the price of that right here it's a really great quality palette it's very beautiful natural for like everyday looks and then there's that pop of like blue right here that you can absolutely use that for like date night or if you just want to play around with some color or you know it's really beautiful so that's a really great quality palette i'm very happy i'm not sad of getting duplicate i am really really happy um, so hopefully one of you will like that. If you've had it um, and you like Wander Beauty, let me know your thoughts and opinions if you like them. Um, next up here is from Teeny. I don't remember trying anything from here, but this is the Detox Green Tea Blend Matcha Lemongrass Clay Mask. Oh, um, here's the packaging. That looks really good, actually. There's a bunch of plastic all over it, so I don't think I'm going to open this. But it does say it's made in Florida, and it's cruelty-free. And this is a leave-on mask that you will leave on from 10 to 15 minutes. So, okay, guys. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this. I'm just going to put it to the side. Um, so, the price will be right here of that clay mask. I'm not mad of getting it, but I'm also like, meh. <laughs> um oh i like this brand so so much now i don't know how to fully pronounce this i call it ilamasqua but i heard people call it like ilamasca i call it ilamasqua i know that sounds super funny and weird but that's how you can like say this brand but this is the hydra setting mist and i really am so excited okay but that that was like that guys i okay i'm just rolling with the punches here yay this is 100 milliliters which is a 3.3 us 
fluid ounce and this is a hydro setting spray um so like hydrating setting spray yes i have dry sensitive skin and i hope this is a good one for me i really do like the simple packaging and i really like these um their eyeshadows and their liners are really really good and i also love their veal it's like a veal jelly primer um hydro veal primer and it comes in the most cutest little black pot ever and it's really really nice hydrating very very cooling soft texture primer that i love applying all over to the face and having the setting spray is so fun um, and so it's hydrating setting spray. So yes, this will hopefully lock in the makeup. I am so excited for that. And I will leave the price right here. Um, and then last but not least, I have this guy. And this is the Bali Bomb Pineapple Lip Scrub. Oh, lip scrub are so good to have, especially like me. I have dry cracked lips and I it's getting better like i tend to drink a lot of water so then it kind of gets better for me but honestly when i'm at work and i'm there's things accessible to me like i'm able to purchase water or purchase something to drink and eat but normally sometimes i'm just so busy that i kind of forget about that i'm thirsty and then my lips are so dry and like they get cracked and sometimes they bleed so a lip scrub like this sometimes it's good for me and other times it could be very like harmful so I think I do want to try this, but I will definitely be careful with it. Like right now, my lips are pretty good. They're pretty hydrated. I feel pretty good. Um, so I, this will be a perfect time to try it. Um, the pot is so cute. Do you guys love? Do you guys like lip scrubs? I love to know. Um, so this is pineapple lip scrub, and the packaging is really really cute. Looks like that. We've tried their lip. I don't think it's. I don't think it's a lip balm or is it a lip oil i don't remember if it's a lip balm or lip oil but that one smells absolutely wonderful and it feels so good and hydrating in the lips so hopefully this will work out for me because i do want to keep this and it looks like that on the inside i want to just like i don't know i swatched eyeshadow so i don't think i'm gonna put that in there right now i will just try this out at another time and i hope it's really good if you guys tried it let me know if you guys like it i'd love to know your thoughts and opinions so okay that was a really great box for february 2022 um you were able to get five full-size products in here you're able to customize um choose one item i don't remember like i don't remember if i did i don't think so um so let's recap and see what i got for the money because they upped the price um again that will be some information i'll leave down below in my description box like up this video if you haven't already if you are enjoying this so far like this up and i still hope that you're watching um if you are let me know if you're still watching okay um so let's recap i got this hydra setting mist from llama squaw Illa mask llama squaw how do you guys pronounce this please let me know in a comment a llama squaw, llama squaw, illa mask. Okay, I got this. <laughs> I got the Bali Balm Pineapple Lip Scrub. I got the Timmy Matcha Mask. I have the Glow Highlighter Palette from Ace Butte. Let me go ahead and put this right away before I forget. The tones in here are so pretty. My my favorite tone, I think, was called Poppin. Yeah, it's called Poppin, and the Poppin is, oops, I'm sorry, is that one right there. Sorry, guys, I'm so sorry. Hope you guys can see. It's this one right here in the corner where my finger is. Such a pretty, pretty shade. Like I said, I'm going to think about it because I do have a lot of palettes and highlighters face palettes stuff like that that i kind of want to declutter so i don't know if i'm going to keep this i probably will just give it away um so yeah just be subscribed and i will always do giveaways and i also do friend mail and secret giveaways so if you are active on my posts and you are watching my video from the from the beginning to the end 
and you guys are like commenting and having a nice detailed comment there that's how i know if you're really active and paying attention and i just select random people at times just to give them something and i just do that from the bottom of my heart because i love you and appreciate you and a little bit goes a long way so no matter if you are visiting me for the first time giving this a like um commenting watching the video in full or some you know i really really do appreciate that and if you guys could really share out this video or my channel or share some other videos that you enjoy from me please share it out that's that will be very so special to me and i will always appreciate that so that's everything from this oh i got the wonder beauty um um wondrous escape palette i told you guys i have this already so i'm gonna give this one away it's brand new with the sticker on it like you see the sticker right there and the sticker here so this is a brand new palette so i have this is mine i swatched it already i'm giving this away and i think that's it right so here's one two three four five that was a fantastic box. I really did like this one. It's perfect. If I didn't have this, I will absolutely love it. Um, but since I have it, I want to give it to one of you guys. So I'm going to give away this teamy mask. I'm giving away the palette. I'm giving away this palette. And I'm keeping these two for myself. So was this worth it for me? Absolutely, yes. I think this is a fantastic box. BoxyCharm, I'm so sad that they upped the price, but I understand like shipping and um, shipping and stuff like that gets really, really up there in price. So I'm not mad at them. I'm just a little like, like it kind of sucks a little bit. You know what I mean? Because I did have to like cancel one of the, one of my accounts that I had. But anyways, what did you guys think about this box? We're going to go into the premium. I'm going to put these away and we will be right, right back. Okay, guys, let's get into the Boxy Premium. Boxy Premium, I believe, is 40 bucks. I don't remember either. They upped the price on that one. They upped the price on all their subscriptions. And I'm just, like, really, really excited for this one because I do think I chose a product for this. So we're going to show you guys the box. And it looks like this. And we're going to open it. Here's some goodies in there. I do see a card. So yay for a card. Um, this one is the Be My Glamantine. And it has like red hearts on there. So pretty for Valentine's Day. I'm going to be creating a Valentine's look. I am so excited. Um, so what... Um, what do you guys think about Valentine's Day? Are you guys going to celebrate it? What are you guys doing? Um, do you guys like Valentine's Day? Are you guys anti-Valentine's? Let me know in a sweet comment. I definitely, I'm probably not going to, I'm probably not going to do anything. Just do my makeup and like make something to eat for my kids or take them out to eat or bring food to the house or, you know, me and my husband will chill with the family and probably watch a movie or something super chill, relaxed. But, um, yeah, that's probably what we're going to do for Valentine's Day. I think it's on Monday, uh, and I'm working Monday, so, yeah, I'll probably be at work. <laughs> and I'll just probably pick up food or something. Probably we'll get pizza or whatever. Um, so, this is the card for February 2022. On the back side, it shows what I got in this box and how much it is. So, I am so happy I got the card because on the other one did not have it. So, let's go right on into this one right here. Yay! This is the She's a Bad Mother Shut Your Mouth Matte Filler Lip Liner. <gasps> bad AMF. And this is from Oma. Oma. Oma Beauty Bad AMF Matte. Okay, I just said that. So this is a what? This is in the shade Angelo. Okay. I love this um, this company mascara. I received a small sample size mascara in an Ipsy Glam bag. That's like the $13 bag and I like the mascara so much. I was going to post the mascara Monday but I forgot. So probably for this Valentine's Day on Monday I'll probably post it up. Um, but yeah. Or I'll probably do another mascara. I don't know. So this is the lip liner. 
I love this shade. It's like a mauve -y. Yay! I love mauves. Okay, so this is a regular pencil that you can sharpen. Looks like that. And I do still have swatches all over now, so excuse that. I'm going to try to swatch it, like, right here. That's really pretty. I like that. That is so pretty. I love that. I'm pretty straightforward when it comes to mauve because I love that. I like that. I want it. <laughs> it's mine. <laughs> so, yay. I was at Walmart the other day and I found their foundation. And this time they had like a lot of shades available. And I found one that would probably match me, but I didn't get it. And I thought I was going to get it. I even made like um in my stories, I was like, oh, I found some products from Mil Milani and Profusion. And this brand was right there. So I found the foundation, but I ended up putting it back with the Profusion palette. Um... I put those back so I can get the Juicy Jazz Times Milani collection. That was uh, $15. It had three pieces in there, and I'm so excited. I got the Milani eyelashes. I got a Milani eyeshadow palette and the setting spray and that collection. So there's four goodies that I'm going to be trying out soon. But anyways, that will be a separate video. This video is a boxy charm. Like up this video if you're enjoying this so far. If you guys like this, let me know. It's like different. It's a dress, but it's like a mini dress where I would probably wear pants because this goes like not very far down. <laughs> This is such a mini mini dress, but nobody will notice if I'm like, wearing pants and like I happen to just like fix the bottom of it Like nobody will notice but anyways, I tend to talk a lot. So if you like that like up this video Okay, so the price of that lip liner from Oma Beauty This is going for $16 and this is the shape and fill your lips to add definition and structure with this highly pigmented silky smooth eyeliner Silky smooth lip liner designed to be worn with your favorite lipstick shade. Absolutely. Oh, and this is a brand new brand to Boxy, which is exciting. Yay! I cannot wait to try that out. I think I'm going to use that today in this video. Um, so from the first unboxing, there's nothing for me to try out, honestly. Um, but I will try out this lip liner and I will just create a fun look or whatever. Um, next item here is, it's called Let's Ace Time. <laughs> Let's hashtag Ace Time. <laughs> Aceology Rose Quartz Gua Sha Facial Massager Lifts, Contours, and Smooths. Okay, honey. Okay. This is the packaging. It's like a white and pink packaging. And the box looks pretty, really, pretty, really good. Pretty, pretty good. <laughs> and it like, oh, it shows you like a cute picture of how to use it. And a small description, which is awesome. So let's see how this is. Oh, I think it's magnetized. That's why I'm like trying to. <laughs> oh, it's fancy. Look, it has a cute little baggie. Oh, how cute. Fancy smancy. And then here's the, oh. Drop that. Oh, this is pretty. I can't even take it out of there. What? <laughs> nope. Can't. Oh, yes, I can. Ooh, this is like mauve and pretty. It almost looks like a heart. I love you guys. Do you accept? Accept my love. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. So, okay, I think I can use this with, like, serums. And, oh, it's freezing. I'm not sure if this is how to use it. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's how you use it or make those faces with it. I'm not sure. But I can get down with this. Yes, ma'am. I wonder how much that one is. That looks expensive. Let me try and see. Um, Melanie, can you drop that thing? Yeah, I dropped in the floor, baby. Okay. Thank, thank you. Okay, so there's a, it's going for $45. This is $45. What? That's expensive. But it's good. Yeah. It's I good. think it's good. It's really good. <laughs> I like it. Okay, next item here is, yeah, thanks. 
I love you, baby. It's so cute. It's small. Yeah. <laughs> so next up here is from Christopher Robin, and this is the broom. Broom? Volumicent. Broom Volumicent Instant. Instant volumizing leave-in mist with rose water lifted, uplifted roots and filler length. This is 150 milliliters and okay. I like the lid. It's like pinky with white. The packaging is like a plasticky, but it feels really nice and sturdy. Like a thick pla plastic packaging, if that makes sense. And then it's like pinky up here. So here's how it looks. It looks really nice. And I think it's for the hair. So let's go ahead and try some. Why not? Let's go ahead and see. Okay. It smells good. It smells good. Okay, it feels good. It smells good and it's a leave-in mist. Yeah, I definitely smell the rose in here and it smells really good. And my hair feels smooth. It doesn't feel sticky or like hard it feels really good like normal okay i like that so far it feels nice the msrp for that one let me see is going for 39 dollars, and that seems to be a reasonable price for this brand i think i've tried like their scalp scrub i've gotten from an allure beauty box a long time ago like every month like it would be like every single month you will receive the same little jar of it and I think I have so many that I I don't know I just put them away um oh next up is from Huda Beauty this is so exciting I have this palette so I'm gonna give this away I actually couldn't find the one that I have but I'm going to put this away. I hope to find mine, my room, like where my beauty space, my beauty stuff is. It's such a mess. I really want to do declutter and like organization over there. It's like a total, total complete mess. And that's, that's like, it's kind of hard for me. Like, I don't know. I just, I don't think I have some time just to sit down to like go through it all, but I chose this to give it away for you guys in a future giveaway. I love this so, so much. I will leave my Huda Beauty haul when I purchase this and I purchase other stuff. I will leave that video down below if you're interested, but this is for one of you. I'm just going to open it to show you guys how it looks on the inside and make sure it's good. So yeah, it's very, very good. So it has a beautiful mirror and these are the shades. I am so excited for one of you. Yay! One of you are going to win this. Um, I'm going to leave this for when... I don't know. I'm just trying to, like, get up there in my subscribers, you know? Like, when I hit my goal, I'm going to have a huge giveaway. And I'm going to have so many things to give away and boxes. So, there's going to be a lot of winners. So, I just really hope that I get there so I can give this away. Come on now, in this video now, there's like three palettes, <laughs> three palettes to give away, and that's awesome. Plus more goodies just from one single sitting of making the video. Like, I have so much more. Like, I, I'm i just like, I can't even show you what I'm working with because I would be so ashamed that I let that go for so long. It's a mess, and it's all beautiful, beautiful products. Everything, skincare, makeup, uh, tools um i even have new clothes that i haven't even put away bags from the dollar tree hauls that i've been wanting to sit down and record tj maxx haul videos ulta video oh my goodness i have at least 12 different videos that i could at least post every single day and you'll have content for like like two weeks worth of content right there like at least 12 videos yeah anyways i one one I'm going to really get down. I'm going to buckle down. I'm going to tell myself like, hey, Jennifer, you need to go ahead and just do it. Um, so the MSRP from that palette from the Huda Beauty Mercury Retrograde Eyeshadow Palette is going for $67. 
and absolutely worth it because I bought it myself and it's a really great beautiful palette and when I find it I will absolutely show you guys in my Instagram story so make sure you're following me on Instagram um at Jenny underscore beauty reviews that's the same as this channel so um I will leave a link down below for that the next one here is this guy I've never seen this brand before um moonlit this is the primed for the night eyeshadow primer base so i don't know if this is like a pigmented i like the packaging it's really really pretty and glittery like reflective um okay that looks really pretty i'm going to try this out because i normally just use concealer but I actually don't have very many eye bases, so I would love to try this out. The MSRP <clears throat> from the Moonlit Makeup Primed for the Night Eyeshadow Primer with the Sheer Natural Tint is a silky, lightweight formula that prevents creasing so it doesn't interfere with your favorite colors. Get primed for the night and enjoy vibrant, lasting color wherever your adventure leads. <clears throat> this is going for $18 and that's okay. Let's see if I like it. I will try this on later. And then I think the last, yeah, the last item here is Vic or Vike. This is the gentle oil-free makeup remover spray with, I'm sorry, with skincare active clean and nourish makeup melt it's a 6.7 fluid ounce and let me just read that again because i didn't read it right the first time this is gentle oil-free makeup remover spray with skincare actives clean and nourish okay i read it that way <laughs> i read it good that time <laughs> sorry um i like to say i have like cat brain but then that's kind of like putting myself down but i don't know how else to say <laughs> so that's that it's to remove makeup and yeah i'll give this a try i'll keep it so let's oh let me tell you how much that goes for okay i am sorry i have kitty cat braid over here <laughs> the the vic or vike beauty makeup melt is going for 24 dollars, and that's really good i see 24 dollars being for this product i hope it works and it says oil free so okay i'll give it a try <laughs> i'm excited for this it's very different though you know it's like i think i'm more excited to try this opposed to getting wipes in a subscription um i am very grateful to receive wipes i'm not saying i don't like getting them i say i would like i'm more excited over this than to get wipes but they're totally good and Let's go ahead and recap before I just keep blah boring. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so for the premium for the 2022 February box from BoxyCharm, I got this Melt um, Makeup Remover Spray. I have the Aceology Rose Quartz Facial Massager. The Gua Sha. Comes in a little cute bag. And this is how it looks. I received the eyeshadow primer from Moonlit and the Oma Beauty lip liner. Last but not least, the Retrograde Mercury from Huda Beauty. So this is the Mercury Retrograde eyeshadow palette from Huda Beauty. This is fantastic. I honestly love premium over the base box. But the base box was so phenomenal that like I am just so happy to be giving away some of those goodies. But the things that I will keep more is from premium, um, which is exciting because I will use absolutely everything except for this because I'm giving this away. <laughs> so this is for one of you, I promise. <laughs> yeah, you guys, that's it for my two unboxings. I'm going to, I don't know, is there enough to try on? I don't think so. Okay, guys, I think we will try on some of the products that I got from the subscription. So I'm going to try out the eyeshadow base. I'm going to try out the setting spray. 
Um, so the eyeshadow base is from Moonlit Cosmetics. I'm gonna try out the lip liner from Oma, Oma Beauty. And I'm going to try the Illamasqua setting spray. I'm gonna try these three things and I will go ahead and put the uses baby to create an eyeshadow look and hopefully use some to like highlight. So we're gonna play with this palette today and I hope you guys don't mind. Um, so I did grab some things to complete a full face over here. I'm going to be using the Fenty, Fenty by Rihanna foundation. I'm gonna use the Glassy Skin Balm by Touch and Soul. I'm gonna use the Jeffree Star Concealer. I'm gonna use a Beaky Blender Beauty Sponge. I'm gonna use the Jeffree Star um, Eyeliner. This is like a dark green shade. I'm gonna use the Kosa's Air Brow Tinted Volum Volumizing Brow Gel from Kosa's. And I'm gonna use the products that I got from the boxes. So let's go right on in and try out the Moonlit Primed for the Night Primer. This is the eyeshadow primer. Let's go in with that baby first. So the packaging looks like this. It's really pretty and glittery. So cute. And we're going to go ahead and go ahead and put some on here. It really does feel lightweight, okay? And I'm just going to pat that in with my finger. And I'm going to put some up to the top of like up here and my brow bone and just really cover that on my eye and up here. It feels really, really smooth and creamy. Okay, it's very light and there's no color switch here i tend to use concealer as eyeshadow base and then like i'll use the concealer and then i'll put some setting powder just to set it and then do my eyeshadow but in this case i am trying this out so okay let's see if it will help prolong eyeshadow i'm gonna jump right on into the wonder beauty wondrous escape eyeshadow palette this eyeshadow palette offers 10 shades i think i'm gonna put this shade called stargaze it's right here and we're gonna put that on the lid I'm gonna just use my finger okay that looks absolutely beautiful i'm going to grab a brush and we're gonna put in the sun kissed shade that's shade that's this right here and we're going to go ahead and put that in the crease Next, we're going to grab this deep chocolatey shade called Overnight, and we're going to really implement that deep brown into the outer. And a little bit into the crease as well. That way, there's a little bit of a definition. There is kickback on the shade, but it's okay. So pretty. I like this a lot. 
here's the eye look and it's very pretty and super easy to create you guys can literally do this in two seconds um that's how long it took me like literally two seconds and it's absolutely easy to work with eyeshadows from wonder beauty and they're so beautiful so again i am very excited to be having this and i am not mad that i got this like a repeat um that that way i can share it with one of you so i am not mad so those are the eyes and they look super beautiful and bronzy goldish tones and so pretty so we're gonna go into the face here and i'm gonna use the glassy skin balm this is from touch and soul and i just like to prime the skin and put this everywhere it's really great super hydrating formula melanie bring me the wipes Are these okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're all done with that. And we're going to go in with the Fenty Beauty. This is the Pro Filter Hydrating Longwear Foundation. The shade I have is 170. And I do like to shake this up a little bit. It has a nice pump. And we're going to bounce that in the skin with my Beaky Blender Beauty Sponge. I honestly, before I do my makeup, I like to always do the eyelids. Um, I like to always do my eyebrows and prime the eyelids with concealer. But since I started off my makeup like the opposite way that I normally do things, I feel a little off balance. But not. But nonetheless, I am very excited to be trying out these products, even though I don't have many things to try out today i think this is a really good yet simple look anybody can create and i am happy for both base box and premium so foundation looks really really good i really am enjoying all the products so far next i'm gonna go in with a little concealer i got this one from jeffree star um the shade i have is c7 and all the products that i'm using in today's video will be in my description box so definitely check down there
I'm gonna go in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Automatic Eyeliner, and this one is in the shade Resting Rich Face. So here's the packaging. And I'm going to put some of this in my waterline. I love the formula of these. I love how it's retractable and it's very, very pigmented, yet the formula is very smooth. And I'm just going to line the waterline. Just like that. And we're going to use that, we're going to put this away and we're going to use the, the shade Sun Kissed right there. And we're going to implement that a little bit and kind of smoke that out at the bottom. So we're just going to use a tiny bit and just really kind of have it like smoke it out and then connect it to the top that way they are connected and blended together and this is a good way to implement some color if you're doing like a bronzy neutral everyday kind of look okay um honestly with this palette there's only fallout i think on this shade so far for what i've been trying um so this one does have a little bit more fa um, fallout more powder than the other ones everything seems to be really nicely balanced and i love this palette so much like i said wonder beauty has really great quality and there are the eyes and face we're gonna go in to the um tinted brow gel from kosas this one i have in the shade dark brown and i'm not gonna use a brow pencil today i totally forgot to get one so we're just gonna use some brow gel here's the packaging i love it And now we're just going to apply that to the brows. I love how it's a light and easy formula. And it's really nicely pigmented that matches my brow color super, super nicely. A little bit goes a long way. And I love how I don't even need to use a brow pencil. Like, look at the difference between that one and this one. Like, a little bit goes a long way and it looks really good. So I love this brow gel. If you haven't tried Cosas. You guys can find them on Sephora. This is really, really nice. And it gives the perfect tint. Yes, easy. Um, let's go in with the lips. I have my, I have this one. This is the Wander Beauty Double Date Lip and Cheek Balm. So you can use this for your lips and your cheeks. I'm going to use them for the lips. Um, but, but first, we're going to go into that new lip liner from Oma Beauty. And we're going to align the lips over here. The shade is Angelo. And if you are enjoying this, please give it a like and leave me a sweet comment. So again, the pencil looks like that. And it's a mauve -y. I did swatch it. It looks like that. So let's go ahead Nothing is on the lips, so we're going to just go ahead go right on in with this lip liner from Oma Beauty.
Ooh. I'm going to see if I can fill in the lips. Yes. Look. That's pretty. It works. So well, and it's creamy. Ooh, honey, I like this. I'm definitely going back to Walmart. I'm definitely going back to Walmart. I'm going to pick up the foundation. I'm going to pick up more lippies wow. and other things that they offer. And wow, I'm really, really excited. Like, Pretty. Now let's get into the lip and cheek um, baby from Wonder Beauty. This is how it looks. It looks almost like a yo-yo. <laughs> it almost looks like a yo-yo, but it's the prettiest ever. Like there's two different tones in here, so you can use them for your lips and cheeks. So here's the balm, like if you want a clear balm, and then there's the color. So there's like two in one. I'm going to grab this baby. And we're going to put this on the lippies. Here's how it looks. And there's a mirror as well. So it comes with mirror. And both sides are so beautiful and creamy. I'm just going to use the palette again for the mirror. And... This makes a perfect blush color. And lip color. So, so pretty. Yeah, I like it. Actually, let me do the mascara on camera. I got the one here from Tristique. And... Wait, did I? Yeah, okay. I got the one from Tristique. It has the little um, eyelash curler that I think it's like a worst contraption ever. I don't think it works for me. But I do like the mascara and the formula is really good. So here's the wand. And if you guys like this contraption of the lash curler, let me know if you like that or if you don't. I'd love to know if you don't like that because <laughs> I don't like it. This mascara, I feel like, is drying out. I've had it for a little while, and I have a little bit left, so I figured I will just finish it up already. Alrighty, I think we're all good. We just need to get some setting spray over here and call it a great video. <laughs> so I'm going to use the Illa Mask Hydra Set Setting Spray that I just got from the base box. And I'm going to shake it a little bit and spray. Okay. The mist is not ultra fine. It is a little bit of a a little bit of a heavier mist, but it's really good nonetheless. I do like it and it smells good. So it felt nice. But let me just be clear and say it's not ultra fine. It's not the finest mist. It does have a little weight to it, like, but it has a good mist. It does evenly disperse the product and I feel like it went everywhere like how a good setting spray should um so let's do a little bit more of the Christopher Robin um instant volume leave-in mist right here just to really implement this more in the video and in my hair so let's go ahead and get some more
Here's the final look, you guys. I am so excited. Yay, 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 yay. What do you guys think? I like it. It was so easy, fun to create. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I did like an hour long video. And if you like long videos like this, I think this is like my first long one hour video if you like it let me know in a sweet comment if you want me to do more longer videos um definitely let me know i am so down to be doing those and let me know what you want to see next for me the next products i'm going to be trying is the full face from wonder beauty and i am so incredibly excited for that one because i just want more people to know about wonder beauty but anyways this was the base and premium unboxing for my boxy charm i tried on the products that i could i will be saving those products for a future giveaway so i will have them in a separate box for the future once my channel grows a little bit more we'll have more giveaways and thank you all for spending some time with me i hope you enjoyed it please give it a big big thumbs up subscribe if you are new here Click that bell post notification that way you're notified when I upload a new video. Also, when I upload giveaway videos. And leave me a sweet comment down below. It's greatly appreciated. Let me know what are your thoughts and opinions. And have a beautiful, blessed day. I love you guys. And are we box twins? What did you get? Did you cancel? What do you think about the prices? And all that stuff. So, yeah. I hope you're doing well. Staying safe. I love you. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.